for victims who suffered abuse while serving their country. Today, finally, an official apology. On behalf of the government, I say sorry. You should never have experienced this abuse. It follows an independent review that's uncovered almost 800 serious allegations, some dating back six decades. In response, the government set up a task force headed by a former military judge and father of a Victoria Cross winner. The DLA Piper review did not purport to identify alleged perpetrators. The work of the task force is likely to do so. The inquiry is expected to run for at least 12 months. It will assess individual complaints, recommend counselling or conciliation, refer claims to police and the military justice system and order compensation payouts. $50,000 maximum will, will no doubt be for uh, the most serious cases. It could also recommend a royal commission into the repeated rape and abuse of recruits at the academy and HMAS Lewin. Defence Chief David Hurley has also said sorry. Some members of the ADF have failed to understand the responsibility that rank imposes. The rank is a privilege and not a licence for domineering, belittling or predatory behaviour. Defence will foot the bill for the review and compensation scheme expected to run into tens of millions of dollars. Zoe Alabone, 7 News.